What's up? It's your boy Roy back again with another episode of the Preaching to the Birds podcast. We like to bring the latest and breaking Eagles news that comes to you. So if you haven't seen yet, I'll put it up for you. But Brian Baldinger had some interesting words about the Eagles and who's going to start at right guard. So we're going to cover that today. And we're just going to make this a quick video. So let's just get into it because I got to go to work. So Brian Baldinger believes that Makai Becton is going to start instead of Tyler Steen. So, my, so this is what Brian Baldinger said. He is the best run blocker that the Eagles have. If he is healthy, he will play right guard for them. They are working him in there. I will keep an eye on Makai. He is on their depth chart backing up my ladder right now at left tackle. He is a big guy. I think Becton has a shot at being right guard. Right now, Tyler Seen probably has advantage there because he knows the system. But that's really just just him, right? Now, personally, I think that Tyler Steen is going to get the nod simply because he reminds Jeff Stoutland of his boy. Yeah, he reminds Jeff Stoutland of his boy. He reminds Jeff Stoutlin of the great Brandon Brooks. You know, the all-pro guard that played for us about five seasons. And I ain't gonna lie. When he was in there, Brandon Brooks was a monster. But personally, 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 while recording this video, I've kind of gotten sold on the thought of Makai Becton being the starting right guard. Now, personally, like I said, or like I'm trying to allude to, I think Tyler Steen is going to get the job simply because he reminds Jeff Stoutlin of the great Brandon books that we used to have. But realistically speaking, my God, if we can get, oh, excuse me for that too, by the way. If we can get Makai Becton over there to play right guard for us, that would be a huge, huge offensive line. Huge offensive line. I mean, to the point where who's going to stop us? We're going to have Cam Jurgens in the center. He might be a little smaller, but he's athletic. He's a little more powerful than Jason Kelsey, if we want to be honest. He might not be as technically sound because he's kind of like entering his rookie season being a center, if you know what I'm saying. Like, it's his first year really playing center. But then to the right of him, you got that big old behemoth, Makai Becton, 6'6", 6'7", 370 pounds. 330 is light for him. If he could get him to play at 330, that would be beautiful. But he's, he's a legit 370 pounds. And then you got Lane Johnson to the right of him. And, you know, Lane Johnson is 6'5", 6'6", in himself. 200, he, he's, he's 330, 350 pounds himself, you know what I'm saying? And then you got Landon Dickerson right next to him over here on the left side, starting at guard, 350 pounds. Then you got Jordan Mailata to finish it off at 360, 375. I mean, Jesus, what are you going to do with that? What are you going to do with that if you are an opposing team? Nothing. If we just run the ball every play, what are they going to do? What are they, what are they going to do? Not a goddamn thing, baby. So it is what it is. I I, I, I expect Tyler Steen to start. However, this is a major however. I would love to see Makai back then start, baby. I would love to see it. I mean, Jesus. Sweet baby Jesus. Please let this man start, Lord Jesus. Please, please, Lord, please. And let this man stay healthy. Because if it happens, man, mind you, Tyler Steen would make a good backup in all other positions except center. We 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 we, we out here winning. This is revenge season, redemption season. Everyone is counting us out, but Howie Roseman. You know what he's about. He 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 he's here to build us a to, to kind of cut off for a bit. But Howie Roseman is here 
to build us a contender. He is here to build us a destroyer. He is here to take over the nation. The Eagles already lead the league in regards to Jalen Hurts quarterback sales of his jerseys. But, boy, we, we here to take over the league. And I don't know why everyone wants to text me while I'm recording. But we over here trying to take over the league, baby. And I'm here for it. I hope y'all are here for it. But who do you guys really want uh, to start at right guard? We got, you know, obviously Tyler Steen, Makai Becton. There are other players, you know, like a Darian Kennard, uh, the former second round pick that we got off of the the, the Bills and the, and the Bengals. I can't remember his name right now. But, yeah, we got a lot of options out here. Who do you guys want? Personally, I'm Brian Baldinger got me sold. I'm like, bro, let me get that Mackay Becton special. I want the Mackay Becton special, baby. I mean, that's a lot of pause. No ditty. That's a lot of beef over there. Who gonna stop us from running with that right there? Not a single person, baby. That's what I'm talking about. And how we rose when we trust. But I'm your boy Roy, and it's time for me to go to work. Peace out. Thank you for watching the Preaching the Birds podcast. Please remember to like and subscribe.